Hey guys, today is day one of the Underhyped Reads Readathon. Um, it is also the day of my band's show, um, so that'll be interesting. I am taking the first book I have to the show with me, and I'm actually, this is one that I was already reading for a different readathon earlier this month, and I am like halfway through it already. I definitely want to finish it by the end of February. I'm also going to try to finish The Witch's Daughter by the end of this readathon as well. We have just loaded all of our gear. In all right, all right, all right. Oh, hello. hello! I didn't Fingers. see you there. Um, here I am reading in the uh, green room ish place. And here are Jamie and Darren looking at the menu. I can't go and see what it has because. Oh, it's delicious! My shadow is over it. How's it going, guys? Hungry. <laughs> So last night's show went amazingly. I'm seriously just blown away by how awesome it was. Like we had so many people show up and they were all awesome people and they really loved the show and all the cool new stuff that we did. Um, all that stuff, like I'm seri I seriously just have so much confidence in this band. It's really awesome. So by the way, um, if you didn't see my tour vlog and all of that stuff, I'm gonna link that down below along with all the um, uh, you know, the links where you can listen to our album and where you can follow us and see our videos and all this other stuff if you want to. Um, so just check that out if you're interested in my band. But anyway, enough of the band, um, back to the books. Um, I have like less than 100 pages left of Ariel and this is just such a good book, I swear. This is the, um, the outfit that, the picture I took at last night's show of my outfit. And, um, then, uh, Vanessa from Paper X Fairy actually pointed out that it looks a lot like, um, the cover of The Witch's Daughter. And I think she's kind of right because, I mean, look at that. Look at the resemblance. Here are some adorable puppies again. Hello, adorable puppies. Hey everyone, I have dogs fighting behind me. Don't know how that happened. Okay, it is um, Tuesday, March 1st. This is day four of the uh, Underhyped Reads readathon. I forgot the name of it for a second there. I'm still reading The Witch's Daughter. I'm only like a hundred pages into it because I did not read enough yesterday, which is insane because my minimum page count for how much I read per day, not during a readathon is a hundred pages. So I feel like during a readathon, I always try to read more than that. And I've been reading like less than that. And so I like, this is the fourth day of a readathon. So by the end of today, I should have read um, at least 400 pages total during the readathon, and I've only read like 300, so hopefully I'll get like over another hundred into it. Fishy has not read anything yet today. Have you, Fishy? His name is not really Fishy, his name is Hank, but he is a Fishy, so I call him Fishy. Today is day five of the readathon, and I'm about to go to California in the morning, um, so... I'm going to take the next book with me. I'm trying to finish The Witch's Daughter by the end of today. Um, and then the next one I'm going to move on to for the underhyped reads is um, Pegasus in Space by Anne McCaffrey. Um, but since I'm going to be gone for obviously longer than this readathon, I'm also taking like a couple other ones. I'm taking The Alienist and I'm taking Voyager. Okay, so basically I'm trying to finish the, the last 100 pages of The Witch's Daughter today um, before I have to go to California in the morning. Um, the next book that I was planning to read for this readathon was The Oathbound by Mercedes Lackey, but since I'm about to go to California and there are only two days left of the readathon anyway, I figured I'd skip right ahead to um, Pegasus in Space by Anne McCaffrey. And basically, if I can finish The Witch's Daughter today and then finish this before the readathon is over, then um, I will have read a thousand pages, which is like my minimum goal for any readathon, pretty much. I am at the airport 
um, beginning my fabulous trip. So um, I did manage to finish The Witch's Daughter yesterday, and I was able to also start um, Pegasus in Space by Anne McCaffrey, and this is probably what I'm going to read on the plane because it's an underhyped book. Yay. Videoing the cat. You sound like a little bird. Kitty. Fluffy poof. Say hello. Uh, So guess what I didn't get to do after I got off the plane? Read. And guess what I didn't get to do very much of the next day? That's right. Read. So here's what, here, so here's what happened. Um, I got to visit both my parents and, um, and get my car a car that was not mine but now it is and there was just a bunch of stuff that had to be done and I was super busy the whole time so really I was like I'm s I was so behind on this whole readathon I feel like but oh well at least I read some stuff so let's take a look at what I read first I finished the second half of Ariel um, which is great then I read The Witch's Daughter, which I had already started, but um, I, but I was only like 50 or 60 pages in, and this is like a, almost a 400 page book, so I guess it's good I at least finish that one. And then I got 110 pages into Pegasus in Space by Anne McCaffrey. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a lot of fun with this readathon if you participated. I loved it, and I'm super excited for the next round. Um, so I will see you soon with another video. Bye!